so guys let's see some behind the scene moments of the latest show on prime video which is ibu cartoons of africa you know featuring to be michael's jimmy alistair onoja timini and a couple of other people so guys let's enjoy Stop playing. Mag the pain. Stylish. Drip out. Your favorite stylish style. Who that be? This blog is specifically for people who have seen the show because if you haven't seen the show, I am sorry. And to be very honest, I would advise you see the show. It is dope. Rwanda is such a beautiful country. Who would even think this country is in Africa? <laughs> So here we have Jimmy dancing with one of the camera crew. Okay, this is funny. Come on! You can tell they had so much fun while filming in Rwanda. Come on! Come on! Come on! If I was in this car, I would definitely scream, drive her back, focus on driving, eh? After you go dance. Maggie Morocco. That's right. Habibi. That's correct. Gong Gong. So here we have All Star and uh, who else? Of course, this is the stylist. And there we have Jimmy. Jimmy's energy. Uh -huh. Oh boy, must be colored. Let's go, baby. One lesson I learned from this show is that boys be cut just like girls. Tell them, boy. Come to Morocco, Habibi. So guys, you know the thing, I really want to see more of such reality shows. One, two, three, go. Three, two, one, action. Come on. Come on. So just in case you didn't get that, there's this stylist called Swanky Jerry. He has this step where he works. Like if you know Swanky Jerry, of course, if you're conversant with the styling, the fashion industry, you should know Swanky Jerry. So you just saw Jimmy trying so hard to remix Swanky Jerry. Who knows? I may just post one of Swanky's videos after at the end of this if I feel like if I remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who you know got swag like this? Who you know you got swag like Zuby? Who you know you got money like Zuby? Who you know you got fresh like Zuby? Avi King Pe David Do. Hey yeah yeah yeah. Ah, I bought. Me, I bought this pants of my own. I said, pay no. You can be bad boy teams. Come on, fuck around, you get killed. Are they done? Late. <laughs> from the behind the scene clips you can tell these guys are not sworn enemies like we all thought yes i mean <laughs> guys this timini is something else hey chidekena nah. for timini to drop hundred dollars <laughs> hey hey oh mother shall you really enter in blood though you don't know what they do because timini on a good day stingy ass F. Come on, Makawa. A1 doings. Where we day? Who, sir? Kegi. Who give him? <laughs> I'm 
guys i always wonder how ibuka who seem really reserved tends to like very crazy people like zubi timini like what's the connection well we are still showing you behind the scene moments from rwanda and morocco Kotsi ibuka turns up africa So, hope you are enjoying the behind the scene, especially people who have seen. Yeah, yeah, the samurai. Otto. Otto. Yeah, That's Africa's richest actor in the world, you know what I mean? She wants a picture. Your smile is priceless. <laughs> Zoom! Stop playing, bro. Stop playing, bro. <laughs> I mean, it's easier to flow if you have seen the show. Here we have Timini and a fan. Guess what time it is? Golf time. You ready, homie? Yeah. Take me to the golf course. Yeah. Yes. Stop fucking. Bro. We ain't playing, man. We're going to play golf. What's your sword? Bad man team. Yeah. Super stuff, bro. Yeah, man. Like... <laughs> so I took my boys out to the golf course. Mm. Hey, homie. We don't play. Gang, gang. We don't play. is here y'all they recognize the hustle so for those of you who have seen the show who is your favorite cast for me my favorite cast is onoja i think he nailed i love how calm he is we have onoja and timini here and uh, you can see onoja asking for his 10 million naira again if you have seen the show you will get it completely onoja is my favorite person he reminds me of myself i can be really calm even when people are going coco that's just the way i am and my least favorite cast has to be, mm, I think, All Star. I didn't really feel his impact that much, even though I don't mind seeing him in next in another season. Yes, not a big deal. Oh well, back in Ninja, they have embarked on a few media rounds. I never would have imagined that Ibuka will ever consent to do a reality show. I have always wondered what is what Ibuka is like, you know, outside Big Brother cameras. But one thing is for sure, Timini pissed me off. Yes, a whole lot. So we have the two who was behind the MIC. One of the biggest TV hosts in Africa. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen. Since the show was released, Ibuka and his guys have been on media rounds talking about the show. He actually took it a step forward to have one of the biggest TV reality You know what? This is Ibuka's first time of being an executive producer. Shows. Ladies and gentlemen, I've got and luckily for him, the show blew. About the one and only Ibuka is in the building. What's good? How you doing, G? So here we have Ibuka and the two. Now, now I know what it is. <laughs> you guys are all my So guys, who is your favorite cast? <laughs> okay, they always say put your money where your mouth is. Is it Ibuka the instigator or Timini the spoiled brat? Tell me you because I really want to know who your faves are. Or is it Jimmy, the Osokoso one be that is always getting angry over things that are very minute and 
unnecessary or is it all star the clown of the group absolutely love all star or is it or not ja hmm, the better picking the quiet one the calm one who is slow to anger and takes in everything and is always ready to apologize or is it zubi the chaotic zubi zubi the drama king as in the biggest actor in africa the one who said he can buy timini oh my god guys that has been the argument for weeks now timini and zubi who is a better actor and who has like a wider reach for me it's zubi of course because with zubi you can, Zubi can go to the market and get mobbed, but if Timini goes to the market, nobody cares about Timini because he is just well known within the cinema circle. Recently, one of these actors that was into that, that's into cinema movies was in the states, and surprisingly, he was flagging down cabs, and nobody even looked at him twice because people barely knew him. Because this, but this guy is a big like when it comes to cinema movies, he's up there. But with Zubi, Zubi has conquered cinema. Zubi has conquered. Asaba, he has conquered YouTube. Oh, more the guy, eh? I must give it to him. Oh, he is truly the biggest in Africa. So, this has been fun, and this is me signing out for all things Ebukaton South Africa. This has been an amazing show, like, I enjoyed it completely. And my favorite part about it is the fact that the boys are really cool, exchanging banters about what happened in Kigali and Morocco. Like, I cannot say the same about True Housewives of Lagos cast too. So I'm totally enjoying everything about him. The way they banter. You see uh, Timini will post like a picture of himself and Zubi and be like me and my buyer. So for me, the positivity among the guys is all that I live for. I mean the positivity post show because it shows that they are all in a good place. I can't wait for them to take another part of the world. Hopefully America, Las Vegas, Paris fingers crossed i just hope people really watched the show so that the producers will be encouraged to spend money again guys this has been amazing so don't forget to share your thoughts in the comment section